It feels like nothing else in the world matters when I do that, when I perform. It's almost like being in a trance. It's all really slow. It feels like I get to be the most successful version of myself without having to you know, hold any feedback. And I don't get to do that anymore. My name is CJ Seymour, I am 18 years old, um, I'm a freshman, currently broadcast journalism major, and um, I make music. So I'm, I'm German, but I grew up in the UK, I stayed there from when I was 8 until I was 13, so my accent's British. That's where I claim most of the time whenever I talk about, you know, where I'm from. Um, I guess I'm from all over because my family is also Nigerian, so that's a part of my ancestry and history. I remember I watched this BET documentary on um, women in hip hop or something, and I was inspired to start like writing from there. And um, also, also because I was tired of like the way that music was, and I thought music was boring and that everything was like a love song, so I was kind of writing music in a way to be like the antagonist to that and like talk about things besides you know your standard stuff so I think that's mainly why I started. Since I grew up in the UK I'm really inspired by British songwriters so people like Lily Allen and Arctic Monkeys um, and then a lot of uh, British rappers that made UK hip-hop and not grime because they're two different kinds but um, so people like Tiny Tampa, Professor Green, example. Um, it was like the British scene of rap is really inspiring. And then also British songwriters who make pop or like indie rock, like Lily Allen, Arctic Monkeys. Also, I'm inspired a lot by my surroundings. Um, so growing up in the UK, there was a heavy concentration of South Asian people. So um, I grew up a lot watching Bollywood movies and listening to Bollywood music. So, and. I had a lot of friends that were from other places, so I was listening to a lot of different music in different languages. So a lot of that inspires like what I write about and like the tone and the quality of my music. Hip hop is very gendered and very heteronormative. So I, you know, being someone who's like gender non-conforming and someone who's queer, it just it's not. I'm not exactly what they expect me to be. So I think. My identity just makes me different without even trying to be. Like the things I talk about, my experiences aren't going to be the same as, you know, a straight black man. Like it's just, it's different when that, and they are usually the majority who are rapping. So I think just my identities just make it that the themes in my music are a whole lot different compared to my counterparts would be. Thick skin is important. Um, fearlessness is also important and also to write about what you know um, like no one is saying that just because you make music you suddenly have to be this queer activist that does it through music but I don't I'm not one to pretend or I'm not gonna write a love song about a boy because I've never experienced that and that's not who I am like I feel like you shouldn't hide your queerness and you should be proud of it and produce that through your music um, and also just to know that you're going to be a minority whenever you walk into a room with musicians. You will be, you might be the only one. Like um, in this group that I'm a part of 3V, most of the people in there are black men, black boys. And I'm the only person there that's, you know, gender non-conforming and, and gay. And it's like, and sometimes it can feel a little isolating. It can feel like... Um, it's scary for me to want to interact with people sometimes because what if they don't like me because of my identity but I think it's to the most important thing is honestly to just believe in yourself and believe in who you are as a person and put that through in your music and don't hide it really uh, come up with raps real quick real hard got a swipe real quick no credit no card I've been going real hard since about 18 but I turned 18 about five months ago don't know what I say what I do is what I know how I flow is where I go tell me what you want to know if you've got a couple questions I don't want to answer I am never one to be a private dancer do a lot of things that you can't really get from me a lot of things people want to get into my head and see if I could be a little more than what they wanted me to be before I open through the door one two three four don't know what I'm saying 
If I was French and I would be Palayan and I really don't know what else to talk about. My name is CJ Run, I'm out.